The conspiracy theory of Big Pharma is a popular belief that the pharmaceutical industry is involved in a secret and coordinated effort to maximize profits by suppressing cures for diseases, manipulating research and clinical trial data, influencing government regulations, and promoting the use of medications that only address symptoms rather than curing illnesses. Proponents of this theory argue that the industry's primary objective is to generate profits, and that they are not interested in developing cures for diseases because it is more profitable to develop and market treatments that only address symptoms, rather than eliminating the root cause of the illness. They also argue that pharmaceutical companies engage in corrupt practices such as paying doctors to prescribe their drugs, suppressing negative research findings, and influencing government regulators to approve their drugs despite potential risks to public health. While it is true that the pharmaceutical industry is profit-driven, and there have been instances of unethical behavior and corruption, there is no evidence to support the idea that there is a coordinated effort to suppress cures or treatments for illnesses. In fact, the development and approval of new drugs is a complex and highly regulated process that involves many stakeholders, including government agencies, independent researchers, and patient advocacy groups. To understand the origins of the Big Pharma conspiracy theory, it is important to examine the historical context in which the pharmaceutical industry operates. The pharmaceutical industry emerged in the late 19th and early 20th centuries as advances in chemistry and medicine led to the development of synthetic drugs that could be mass-produced and marketed to a wide audience. Over time, the pharmaceutical industry became increasingly consolidated, with a few large companies dominating the market. This consolidation led to concerns about monopolistic practices and a concentration of power in the hands of a few corporations. These concerns were further amplified by the rise of consumer activism and the growth of the environmental and health movements in the 1960s and 1970s. One of the most well-known examples of the Big Pharma conspiracy theory is the belief that pharmaceutical companies are suppressing cures for cancer. Proponents of this theory argue that the industry has little interest in finding a cure for cancer because it would cut into their profits from cancer treatments, such as chemotherapy and radiation therapy. However, there is no evidence to support this claim. Cancer research is a highly competitive field, and there are many independent researchers and organizations dedicated to finding cures for cancer. Moreover, the development and approval of new cancer treatments is a rigorous and highly regulated process that involves many stakeholders, including government agencies, independent researchers, and patient advocacy groups. Another popular aspect of the Big Pharma conspiracy theory is the belief that pharmaceutical companies engage in corrupt practices such as paying doctors to prescribe their drugs and suppressing negative research findings. While there have been instances of unethical behavior and corruption in the pharmaceutical industry, these practices are generally not widespread, and the industry is heavily regulated to prevent such abuses. It is important to note that the pharmaceutical industry has also made significant contributions to public health. The development of vaccines, antibiotics, and other life-saving drugs has led to dramatic improvements in human health and longevity. While the industry's primary motivation may be profit, the development of new drugs and treatments has the potential to save countless lives and improve the quality of life for millions of people. In conclusion, while it is important to be critical of the pharmaceutical industry and hold them accountable for their actions, the conspiracy theory of Big Pharma is not supported by evidence and may undermine trust in the healthcare system, ultimately leading to negative health outcomes. The pharmaceutical industry is a complex and highly regulated sector that plays a critical role in the development and delivery of life-saving drugs and treatments. While there are certainly legitimate concerns about the industry's practices, it is important to base these concerns on evidence rather than conspiracy theories.